Uh, in this two circle, there is a common tangent PCQ. At the same time, AB is the tangent of the smaller circle here. And then our target is to get the angle ABC. Uh, first, you are going to try your best to use AV properties. Especially, they say that this is tangent, so there should be some indication. But anyway, start from 100 degree first. Obviously, this one is 80 degree. And also, we are going to use this angle. Obviously, for tangent, a very common thing is the angle in alternate segment. So these two angles are the same. But we have no triangle inside the small triangle here. So therefore, I create a triangle here. So I can say that this is angle in this segment, minus segment, and then angle in major segment. Do not touch this line, the opposite angle. This is 35 degree. At the same time, don't forget that there is a quadrilateral. Psychic quadrilateral opposite angles are the same. So this is 80, which means this is uh, 100. Or you may directly use exterior angle of psychic quadrilateral. We get this angle is 100 degree. Now, the triangle that we create is really useful here. We can just be use angle sum of triangle, 180 minus 100 minus 35 degree. We have 45 degree here. And don't forget that there is still only one information we didn't use. We didn't use the information AB is a tangent. So obviously we have angle here and it should equal to do not touch this side, this angle. So this is also 45 degree. And together with your target exterior angle of triangle, this plus this should equal to 100. So that's why this is uh, 55 degree here. And that's our answer. Uh, of course, there are many different order of calculation here. But basically, you can uh, skip this step to draw some line to help you separate different sections of the angle.